Hello, I am Fury Cat, and welcome back to our Crusader Kings 3 Let's Play as the Kingdom of Alba. So previously, having managed to reclaim our rightful uh, throne, having been usurped and uh, relegated to merely being uh, the Duke of Sirsin here, uh, we've retaken the throne and we've been cautiously expanding, building back up, and focusing on our personal domain to try and maximize our income and uh, of course our uh, our army uh, whilst you know nibbling off little bits and pieces here and there and trying to keep the kind of culture uh, fairly homogenous uh, and of course keep everybody good and Catholic um, now I think one of the problems we've been having with control uh, which I'm sure one of these buttons maybe shows me I don't know uh, but our vassals keep warring amongst themselves for control of various bits of land. Whenever you siege a territory, uh, it impacts the control, um, which is a bit of a problem. But we don't really have a good way of stopping our various vassals from warring with one another at the moment, so yeah, not a lot we can do with that. We're also in a war, apparently. Um, Barcelona want something or other. The shake, the, the shakedom of L Leda. They've taken on... The Umayyad Empire, which I feel is maybe a little bit, you know, optimistic for Barcelona. I mean, they've got bits and pieces over here, but I think they may be uh, punching a bit above their weight, which means I think they may be relying uh, on us coming and helping them. So, you know, I mean, since these are, you know, he's a good Christian, a uh, good Catholic ruler, we might, we might actually go down and, you know, give him a bit of a hand. And we're not going to do that because it's dumb. Um, do want to grant titles? We've got low count, yeah. Ah, yes, powerful vassals. Uh, you suck. I mean, you'd be a great bishop. Like, I'd make you my archbishop if I could, because, like, you're actually better than this guy, but not really a thing I can do. And, uh, you also kind of suck. So, you guys can just go on wanting. And especially, we can declare wars, but we're in one, so probably shouldn't. Uh, let me guess, have you been fornicating? You have been fornicating, I mean. All goes around. Uh, we can also change uh, somebody's contract. Um, a ruler of Athol. Now, aren't we trying to? I remember that we were trying to murder him. We're trying to murder. Yeah, we're, we're, I think we're trying to murder his uh, his heir, if I remember correctly. Yeah, we are. We're attempting to mur murder his heir. So we have a hook on him. But we, I don't know. Well, having a hook on him is not that brilliant, so we could maybe... Well, I think we want to hang on to the hook, because if our murdering goes awry, uh, and we can't murder our way into his territory, then uh, we may just use the hook to revoke his title and go, eh, no. We'll just accept the fact that we're, you know, uh, a tyrant at that point, because... Eh. Uh, we're, we're in poor health now. We are starting to get on a bit, so it's a good possibility that our... Uh, our daughter, Princess Caitlin, here is going to uh, secede us sometime fairly soon. But uh, in the meantime, let's get our armies together and uh, see about you know going off and are taking in this war. I'm going to be raising in multiple places here, and I'm not entirely certain why. But uh, sure, okay, well, let's join you two together to a glorious hole. Uh, oh, there's y'all. Who's in command? You. You really the best we can do. Can get this guy, my marshal, to lead. Yes, marshal, go command this army. We've got, um, you know, heathens to kill. Uh, where should we depart our army for? That's quite a substantial army they've managed to raise. Well, let's head down here. Uh, oh, are we really going to come in from up this way? Eh, uh, sure, why not? Okay. Right, off you go. Oh, we are winning the war already, wow. Maybe he hasn't bitten off more than he can chew, maybe. Maybe this man knows something we don't. He's, well, maybe he's got other allies, actually. Yeah, it looks like he may have a good few allies, so... Well, let's go help him out, nonetheless. Never never let it be said that we're we're not a good ally. And just wait on this army getting off to... There we go, off to sea, along with a big chunk of my money. Uh, we've swayed this guy, oh, that's good. We, you know, we want our counsellors to like us. I'm intrigued to know how our uh, murder plot's getting on. Two months. Ooh, it's dicey. It's dicey. Probably fine. 
Uh, time has come. My agents are in place. One of them will pay the assassin the very night the deed will happen. Another will ensure the wall is unguarded. A third will leave a subtle trail of candles to Regan's bedchamber. Everything is in place. Well, let's, let's roll the dice. He escaped unharmed. The assassin made it inside the castle, did not reach Regan's chambers. When he was spotted and the alarm was raised, the assassin immediately made his escape and has not been heard from since. Regan is now on his guard. He will pay someday, Regan. So do we end our scheme? He's going to gain Watchful, which Hostile Scream Resistance 5, or we can just keep trying. Uh, I mean, what's that going to do to our chances? It's actually fairly comparable. You get any more agents? Oh, hello. You can be convinced with the application of a small amount of money I get on my scheme. Come join, come join. There we go, a bit there. 67% will take that. I'm sure we can get him this time. 11 months, well, let's see what we can manage. Okay, so they've got armies down here which we should maybe go and see about crushing. You're going over here. No, you're going over there. Are these allies of theirs that are coming to join up? It's difficult to tell. Umiad is big. You're heading over the mountain. No, you're coming back. Let's see if we can catch him here and crush this army in battle. That'll be worth a little bit. Uh, what we got going on? I can ask my head of faith for gold. Well, I mean, I am kind of losing money in this battle against heathens. So, you know, I think it's the least you could do, frankly. Is, you know, give money to me as a good Catholic who's busy fighting these heathens. Declare wars. Yeah, I'm not... Yeah. <laughs> Not right now, I'm in one. Okay, let's see if we can go and intercept these guys. Come on, hold still. Hold still. Come on, catch him. Hold. There we go, we got him. Let's give him a good caning. Yeah, there we go, easy. Easy win. Oh, and we stack wipe them for good measure. That's outstanding. That gives us some good uh, good work done. Uh, so let's see what can we go and lay siege to down here. Mm, yeah, that looks siegeable. Let's go siege that. This war appears to be going reasonably well. Uh, I can compliment this man on his strength of arm. I mean, he's got quite a decent prowess. So yeah, strength of arm. A big strong man. Oh, here's a here's an army. Let's go and crush them in battle. Yes, come to me. Excellent. He likes me even more. That's what I like to see. Yes. No. 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 Hold still. Hold still. Yes. Hold, come. Come. Come to battle. Oh, and a new stewardship perk. Hooray! We're an architect. Probably not long before we die, but you know. Eh. What else should we do? Um, I don't know, we could go some marshal, marshalling, maybe. Or a uh, bit of intrigue. I think a bit of intrigue might actually not be so terrible. Yeah. Let's, let's go for the, 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 the skullduggery focus. Because we are trying to murder somebody at the moment, so you know. Uh, how does, does that improve our murdering chances? It gives us a better one, isn't it? And we can convince this person to join. Yes, come join the scheme. Is this is other brother. Hey, come help me murder your brother. I'm sure it'll be fine. Come on, hold still. Hold still. We need to murder you. There we go. Gotcha. Another agent. Good. Uh, ooh, this isn't going so good. We've got the numbers, Edge. Come on. Crush them. Uh, my grandson's injured. Is this the one I want to inherit? No. Will they care then? Come on, win the battle. Oh no, they've got reinforcements coming. Where's my allies? Come on, win. Win. Oh dear, that's not looking good. Um, one of my vassals has been wounded. Oh well. Bit of a shame. Uh, my grandson, Daniel. Are you the one? No, you're the same one. You're like super wounded now. Well. My knight has been injured. Good grief, we're not doing well in this battle. What are you lot doing? Counselor died. I lot help you lot were. Uh, he should make up the right constraint. Do I not have a? Oh dear, hang on. 
We don't have a physician. Do we not have... No, we don't have a physician. Okay, well, let's search for a physician. You're going to need one of them. Uh, and we've got a counselor cact at there. Oh gosh, our spy master. That's not good. We need a we need a good spy master. My granddaughter. Wow, she's amazing at it. Sixteen year old. Help me murder this man and steal his land. Cheers, love. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we lost that balance. It's not so great. Um, man, payments from this guy. Sure. Give me the money. Uh, Siobhan can marry. Oh, is this my, my spy master? Yes, my granddaughter and spy master. Good grief, look at her. Wow. Uh, she, I wonder if we can... Let's, let's have a look. Look for inheritable. I'll deal with this in a minute. I'm going to go for uh, inheritable traits. And we'll sort you by age. Let's find someone who's reasonably close to her age. And marry her off to some old man. Uh, I mean, I know it was kind of the done thing. Yeah, this guy's 20. And is Herculean, which would probably pair well with this. So why don't you marry him, and it will be matrilineal, so they will be in our dynasty. There you go. Wish you uh, someone who's plotting against me will stop the villain. Okay, we've sorted things out. Court position. Um, oh, you look good, yeah. Way better than her. Yeah, we'll take... Is this Aileen? Yeah, we'll take you. There you go. Uh, great, you accept the marriage proposal. You're, we're retreating there. And now, see, this is what you get for not coming and help me out in battle. If you'd come and help me when I was fighting them up here, we might have actually won. Well, in fact, the courtiers will scheme and plot, but I may be able to use this to my advantage. If I can keep my courtiers suspicious of each other and distracted with infighting, well, not the time or resources to scheme against me. Uh, so I can spread rumors at once. Is this my wife? Six percent chance. I can get court spies. Scheme resistance plus which is potentially good. Or but that doesn't get me this. Yeah, I'll take that intrigue lifestyle experience. Outstanding. Hey, come on, let's. We've got to come and rendezvous with our. And get away from them. Don't get caught. Oh dearie me. See, if you'd come and help me earlier, we could have. Maybe maybe we can yet get there. Action against me, oh god. We'll deal with that in a moment. Come on, see if we can get, get to this battle in time to influence it. And we're gonna try. It looks like our allies are coming with us, at least. Uh, Vegan will attend a local celebration in Gowrie, and I happen to know he's a bit of a wine aficionado. I could lure him into the cellar of my castle for an exclusive tasting, then make sure he never walks out again. This will be easy. Regan is dead, walled up, and soon to be forgotten. He followed me willingly, drunk on merriment and wine into the cellar. After many glasses of fine wine, he fell readily asleep and didn't even stir as I brought out a trowel and methodically bricked up the exit. Fortunately, no one seems to have noticed the queer new wall in my basement. May he rest in peace. That was good. Got him. Okay, let's, uh, let's deal with this battle if we can. Come on. Come on, get in there. Get in there. Oh, yeah, there we go. Hey, We've arrived. Give them a good doing. Come on, you're better than they are. Oh, they've got camels and armored horsemen and all kinds of crazy stuff. Claim throne. My vassal has laid claim to the kingdom of Alba. Apparently, there was a strategic marriage between our dynasty some generations ago, which is now leading into an inheritance dispute. Claims are entirely fabricated. There's enough uncertainty to pose a real threat. Should others support them? Does he really think he'll get away with this? Let's have a wee look. Who's this that's... So, uh, no, hang on, I want factions against me. Is it this guy? No. Oh, it's been abandoned. Well, that didn't take long. Yes, we will crush them in battle. Oh, yeah, see, we've got more troops arriving. Oh, yeah, go and feed more of your men into the meat, blank, meat grinder. Go and crush these guys as well. Come on, get them. Oh, we've caught some of them. That was an epic battle, that one. We've won again. Good. Okay, so we've nearly won this. Uh, we're not laying siege down here. We could go and siege this down. Hmm. 
All right, let's uh, hang on. Let's. Oh yeah, the faction disbanded, and these guys don't. Well, this is annoying. This faction here. Who are you? No, Duchess of Northumbria. We might have to murder you, but and we've got. Let's have a look. Who's next on our, our chopping block? Uh, so your primary heir is this guy. Um. Okay. Who the heck are you? I have no idea who you are. But you're going to die. Yes, we're going to murder you. Look, uh, 46% chance I'm sure we can do better than that. Apparently not. Hmm. 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 Wait. Um. Oh wow, we've got this chap helping us. 46. Uh, well, we'll give it a go. Oh, we've finished promoting culture. Excellent. Is there any more culture needs to be promoted? Um, this is all looking one. Oh, hang on, Orkney. Alright, this is all. Okay, let's promote an Orkney then. Uh, yeah, get that culture promoted. Alright, ah, how's our war going? Oh goodness, they're bringing more troops. Come on, you guys, come and help! See, these guys are like the worst allies. Come down here to help you in your war. And you're just you're apparently not interested in actually winning it. You're gonna lose this war because you suck. Frankly. And actually, I'm inclined to just away him and let you on with it. If you're going to be terrible allies like this, then I don't see why I should be helping you. Yeah, see, they're just going to pick all these armies off now because they wouldn't come and stand with us. So, yeah, sorry, I'm away here. This is your problem. Okay. Uh, right, we finished building... Uh, where did we finish building? Was it in Aberdeen? It was in Aberdeen. Increase our barracks here. What does the next rank of this do? It gives us heavy infantry, spearman damage, and levy, more levies. Ah, why not? Let's do that. Looks good. Okay. We'll have a wee bit of peace for a while. I've got to let my levies require, uh, recover anyway. Uh, we didn't sway the Duke. Um, well, that's fine. Why does everybody on the council like me? This guy doesn't really care for me. We might have to sway him a little bit. I'm surprised my granddaughter doesn't like me. Why do you not like me? Because I'm sadistic. Wow. Hmm. We'll see. Uh, oh, somebody gained an opinion of me. That's nice. That's going to take some time. This is taking ages. You're losing your war. That's what you get. Tony Troubles. As king, I have been obliged to attend a local jousting tournament. The contestants have been delayed. The tourney won't start for at least another hour. Mormor Corbin of Ross is here, and as always, is being an insufferable lout. His constant complaining is making everyone even more miserable than normal. Meanwhile, my vassal, Duchess Asta, is sitting under the pavilion, clearly bored halfway to death. So I can spend some time with Asta, and she'll become my friend. Well, that's Duchess of Northumbria. Yeah, let's, let's get her to be my friend. Uh, to put on an act, an overwhelmed whisper and a sharp glare are the final piece that makes the puzzle fall into place. My granddaughter, Siobhan, is more well-versed in the art of intrigue than she would, ha than she would have everyone believe. I know there's a woman like that at court it makes me rather nervous. However, I might learn a lot if I can get her to trust me. I'll convince her that we are cut the same cloth. Yes. Excellent. We've disbanded a faction. Uh, it takes many days, but long last I coincidentally stumble upon Siobhan while she's alone. Lady Siobhan, I've been meaning to. You walked into a room to find your spouse yelling at a young page for dropping a plate. What would you do? Is she testing me? Maybe this is my opportunity to convince her we have a lot in common. Uh, so let's see. She's temperate, deceitful, and humble. 
Hmm. I wonder. Yes, they would both have to tell me what happened. Hmm. She pauses, thoughtful, before continuing. In the middle of a march to battle, just as you are setting up camp, an officer approaches you to ask what should be done with a spy that has been caught. So do we make an example of the spy? Do we make sure they're treated well? Or do we talk to the spy and see what they have to say? Yeah, we, I mean, you're obviously going to want to know what that spy's got to say. My agents have scheduled a journey for Dickel. Dickel? Hmm. She'll take them through dark woods. All that's missing is a band of thugs that will tragically slay them in a highway robbery gone wrong. I already imagine the blood seeping into the dark soil. Oh, the woods could be such a dangerous place. It's not a great chance, but let's give it a go. He's escaped God's judgment. Damn him. I heard thugs failed to overpower yet in you. Worse still, a few of them were captured alive and revealed they'd been paid for the attack. It did not take long to trace the payment back to me. Oh dear. Well, we're not going to get him. That's upsetting. Her eyebrows creep down, her gaze grows cold. You make a decision, say, that all taxes in a county will be raised. It comes to your attention that one of your vassals openly questions that decision. How do you react? Do we ignore the slight, no need to make a scene, confront them loudly? The difference in opinion should be solved by discussion. Yes, I think we discuss. He may yet win his war, we'll see. This is where their big doomstack went. Your culture is now fascinated by hereditary rule. Interesting. She frowns to take a step back. I'd appreciate it if you did not approach me regarding this again. Before I have time to respond, she has already started moving down the hallway, every step cloaking her farther in shadow. She sure is a mystery, but I gain learning to read people. Eh, plus five scheme power, that's pretty good. Grant the title, not likely. Now, do we have any factions that need dealing with? Uh, just peasants. Uh, we have, unfortunately, failed in our attempts to murder... Uh, this chap's heir, which is a bit of a shame. Where is, does he have, is he landed at the moment? No, he just has a claim on Mormon Athol. And he does not care for me because I attempted to murder him. I mean, how does this guy feel about me? He's not too happy either. Do we just revoke his title? What will that actually do? He will accept. Uh, control level will drop. Subjects lose 20 opinion of me. I mean, I'm close to dead. I think. So yeah, let's just revoke that. There we go. Mine. Give. Uh, okay, let's have a wee look here. Locate control will deal with that. We can vassalize this chap. This is the guy we just literally disinherited, no. Hmm. Sure, you can become my vassal. Declare a bunch of wars, but that's fine, we're just vassalizing this guy. Uh, oh, every courtier gained 10 opinion of me to counteract my, you know, act of tyranny. It'll be fine. Uh, okay. So, yeah, he likes us reasonably well, she likes us reasonably well. I think this is who we need to work on next. Let's, um... Sway him. There we go. Okay. So we've got Dunkeld, which is good. How does Dunkeld look development wise? Eh, so so. We're gonna have to work on that. Uh yes! You are now vassalized. Welcome on board. Uh you are either Gaelic and Cath Catholic, so I don't even need to do anything there. Brilliant. Always good to have another vassal. And transfer uh, that chap to her. Hmm. I'll write that wrong. Give me more money. Um. So she'll like me a bunch, and she doesn't really care for me now. What does she all have? Oh, she's no, no. She's far too powerful. She's my friend. 
Even though she apparently doesn't like me. Sure, go on then. Go be her vassal. Make her like me a bit more. Doesn't really affect my income that much. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, here comes more of their troops. I don't think they're going to win this. Well, I mean, he's at 93%, 94%. He's doing pretty good. He may actually pip this. Intriguing. Oh, we helped. I've got an awful lot of money. We should probably build something. Let's have a look. What can we do? I think we can do in St. Johnson. Um, I don't think we can do any of this. Yeah, no, no, none, none of these are available. We, have, we were not knowledgeable enough to build any of these. Uh, we could upgrade our castle from a simple earthworks. And we, oh, well, these are the hill forts, so we could construct some ditches as well, which... Uh, some more defender advantage, more fort level, a bigger garrison... Makes our spearmen a bit better. Or do we upgrade our castle? I think we can do that. Because I don't think we're allowed to... Yeah, we can't upgrade any of these. Yeah, we don't have the right innovations, which is upsetting. Um, Starling's pretty much max. We could upgrade the castle, I suppose, here. I see. Uh, Aberdeen's already working on something Dunkeld. I suppose we could start working to improve Dunkeld. Let's have a look at doing that. Um, what do we want here? Hill farms, more money, astral lands. Gives us a bit more levies. Uh, let's go for the hill farms. Construct them. There we go. Yes, yeah, make it better. What about Lanark? Is there anything we can do here? We could upgrade our barracks. More spearmen and heavy infantry. Um, toughness and damage. Sure. Do that. Okay. How does our actual retinue look at the moment? So we've got... Um, picked up a bunch more bowmen. I don't know why these are separate to these. This, this seems pointless. We'll get rid of that regiment. And we can, I guess, increase them a bit. And we've got pikemen... What else can we create? Armoured footmen are an option. Uh, let's hold off for just now. I mean, we're a bit short on cash anyway, so that's fine. There we go, spend a bit of money. Is he actually going to pull this off? He might actually pull this off, because I think he's going to finish Siege in here before they can get this dealt with. Which I think might pop him over. Does the AI realise it? No, the AI is derping around largely and effectually. How about that? He's won that. Yeah, there you go, 100%. He's he's done it. We'll go on. Fish, you know, enforce your claims. What are you waiting for? Come on. You've won. There you go. We won the war. Cool. What did we get out of it? Um, yeah, a bit of prestige and some opinion. Yeah, so be it. So how does he like us now? He likes us quite a bit. Contributed in one of my wars. Yes, yes I did. Helped make Barcelona that bit bigger. I mean, we've got to do what we can to help our good Catholic brethren down here stand firm against this tide of infidels. England looks a bit different to what I remember. Iceland look yeah. I don't I don't even know. I don't know. Alright. Is there anybody we should be murdering? Swaying you, that's fine. Actions are just peasants, so murdering doesn't really help there. What about... How likely are we to be able to murder her? Not very. Ah, you've converted faith. Very, very good. Um, And there is no more faith to convert, so I guess we'll keep you on religious relations. Seems good. I can feel it in my very bones. Death will come for me soon. Like an old friend, he is patiently waiting to receive me. I will be dead within a year. Get my affairs in order. Yes, yes, I should. Not that there's much else to do, really, at this juncture. Living grounds have been constructed in Aberdeen. Excellent. I think we're we're out of upgrades for Aberdeen. 
Um, I guess we could upgrade the castle. Well, that's going to cost a fortune, so maybe not right now. Yeah, I don't think we've got a huge amount to do here, really. Fair wars, eh. Not this point. Ah, oh, we've got a perk. Hooray! Eh. Fabricate hook scheme. Sure, why not? I mean, we're not going to get to complete this, but... Because I'll be dead within a year and my glorious daughter will take over as Queen of Alba. We'll have our second queen. She maybe overheard the main limit. What on earth has happened here? Uh, my new acquaintance, Derigel. Uh... Don't imagine what use I actually have of her, but, you know. I'm going to be dead soon. I mean, we've had a good old reign. We're 71 years old. Good grief. How long have we reigned? Is there a way to check? I'm sure there, I'm sure there must be a way to check how long we've reigned. Is it here? Uh, 20 claimants. Good grief. Um, so we've got a grandson who's imprisoned. My great-grandson and my other grandson. We need to do something about him. He could be a problem. He looks actually pretty decent. And he's having super children, which is good. What we want, super babies. A long breeding program. Ooh, what we got going on here? Martial guidance. Ah, popular opinion, plus 50. Excellent. Making people in Mori like us a bit more. Uh, we've swayed Azric, he likes a bit more, and I suspect it's probably irrelevant at this point, because we're about to have to start over on the whole swaying business with our new queen. Uh, who, who, what, where, where? Who wants me to join? Against the tyranny of Duke, some guy. Oh right, are these guys attacking him? Who are you? Oh, you're the Duke of Barcelona. I've just been in one of your wars. I lost. Spectral Alliance is about to be over anyway when, you know, I cack it and my daughter takes over, so eh. Faction targeting is disbanded, that's good. But I'm anticipating we're going to have a whole lot of new factions when our Queen takes over. And it seems likely she may well be over her domain limit. Um, yeah, 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 she is definitely going to be, although her spouse is pretty boss, so if we have him help out, that might be, might be alright, I suppose. Uh, she's not going to have a long rail. She's a, she's a drunkard, and she's 51 already. That's fine, her grandson's waiting in the, waiting in the wings. Well, he guy's in prison, I have to do something for that. Curse undone. Ah, oh, this guy's died. Who were you again? I have no idea. My rival. He's dead anyway. Bye. How many in the dungeons? Gosh, we've got loads of food in the dungeons. I can get money for you. You will do it for a favor. I don't really care about that. You will do it for a favor. Weak hook. Yeah, it's all looking like weak. Looks a bit boring, really. And will these still be in the prison when I take over as my, my new... A lot of these folk are, you know, heretics, basically, so we could just, you know, murder them all right out the gate to get a load of dread for our queen and stop people scheming against us. That might work. I guess we shall see. A good chunk of change built up here. You may wish to invest in another castle upgrade. Sterling, perhaps. 467, I guess it's going to be the same if I try and do it here. 467, yeah, so we might upgrade Sterling then, because it's got higher, slightly higher income, so. How much do we need, though? Ooh, I don't know if we're going to get there before. Before I die. No, there we go, I'm dead. Uh, I reigned for 49 years, not bad. 
Night of old age. I was the culture head. I was dreaded. I was illustrious. I was a devoted servant. And I fought 21 wars. Mostly defensive. Welcome, Queen Caitlin. Let's see how she can do. Okay, let's have a look here. So, dynasty head's changed. That's annoying. That pause. Faction already. And does my archbishop... He does endorse me at least. Well, that's good. Not adopting that. Uh, I've got to do a lifestyle. What has she been doing? She's been doing that. Okay, she's, she's whole of body. That's good. Now she's going down the theologian. Eh... I'm not too fussed about that. Let's prop up her stewardship then, shall we? Yes. Like that. Let's focus on stewardship. Uh, council. Right, let's have a look at the council. Um, right, we need a good chancellor. Who's good at chancelloring? You're amazing at chancelloring. We have a powerful vassal who's good, not really. So, you can be my Chancellor and get yeah, domestic affairs. Uh, let's have a look for Steward. Who's good at stewarding? We've got a Knight who's good at stewarding. Any, again, any powerful. You're about the bent. You're going to be my Marshal, though, so that's fine. We don't need you to steward. So, cool. You are now my steward. Marshal wise, that's going to be you. And my Spymaster is my daughter. Do you have any better options, actually? <laughs> no. No, we do not. Okay, so you're just going to take care of that. Dangerous fact I have grief. Oh my goodness. Lower Crown Authority, led by her. I doubt we're going to be able to murder her in eight months flat. Right, let's, let's go to the dungeons. Oh look, we do still have all these prisoners. Uh, right, bye. All these Astro, bye. You asked the truth. Uh, yep. Bye. Burn them at the stake. What about you? Yeah, you're evil. Burn at the stake. Burn at the stake. Uh, who are you? Yeah, whatever. Burn him at the stake as well. Right, there we go. That, that should get us a bit of dread, which hopefully will help matters slightly. Uh, I can already ask my head of faithful gold, which I may need for mercenaries momentarily, so yes. You want a council position. Tough. Now we can hear wars, but I suspect we're about to be in some. Family members can get married. Oh, good. My daughter can get married. She's pretty smart. We may need some alliances here, so let's have a look, see what we can get in the way of alliance power. Uh, you're amazing, but you're one, so probably not great. What about this chap here? How many troops do you bring to the table? Um, father of this guy. Eh. Uh, what about you? This is your liege. Mm. What are you? No, 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 back, back, back. Who are you? Gosh, he looks a bit evil. Uh, your leash is this guy. Eh. And, mm. Hmm. You'll do. Ask her marry him. Let me uh my half sister can marry. Isn't that nice? Uh how old is she? Thirty eight, oh, okay. Here, marry that guy. Yeah, so off you go. Uh, get me some stuff there. I can designate a this is my son, the one I don't want to inherit. I can give a guardian. Sure up me. I'll 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 guardian him. Can imprison criminals fornicating. Well, of course. <laughs> what else would it be? Okay, there we go. That tidies up a load of stuff here. Uh, 
Yep, you're gonna give me money. Brilliant. How's Madrid looking? Outstanding. Got an alliance there. Good. Alliance front with you. Good. We've got some good alliances. Negotiate alliance with this guy. Sure. Oh, look at that. This faction has suddenly gotten a lot weaker as a load of folk go, uh, no, she's terrifying. We don't want to be against her. Good bit of dread out the gate. We might have to have her murdered. Bunch of Northumbria, eh? Okay, where's my spy master? I'm the new head of the dynasty. Oh, good. A look at our thing. What are we... What are we working on? Hereditary rule. Or we're being exposed to the armillary sphere. Gives us increased naval speed. Yeah. 22 years to hereditary rule. Yeah, I mean, sure. Or do we just focus on this and blitz through them faster? It takes that to 14 years. Uh, sure, we'll work on that. Okay. All right, our dangerous faction has been... Oh, good grief. Whoa, 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 whoa. what happened to our domain? Hmm... Well, that's not great. Who's this guy? My nephew. Why's he got this? Oh, this partition rule is going to be the death of me. Yeah, my nephew's got a whole bunch of stuff that used to be mine. <sighs> what do we have? We've got Durham, St. Johnson, Penfro, which is kind of pointless. And, of course, we kept useless Thurzo. Great. Uh, this confederate, this partition nonsense is really not great for us. We're gonna have to start getting our lands back. So, okay. Me nephew here. Who's his heir? My niece. Where is she? He's way overseas. He's like over here, apparently. Ugh, right. Let's look at my council. Okay, most folk. Well, hmm. Uh, let's get you on side. Uh, at least my daughter likes me. Okay, so let's get her working on finding some secrets. Hang on. Right, let's figure out where where do I need to go because we want to get rid of his primary heir, which is so she's here in Friedeberg. Okay, you go and find me some secrets down there so we can have her killed. Ah, this just work, work, work. Our domain limit's not too bad though, so. We're, we're quite cash rich at the moment, although we're lacking places to develop. I suppose we can develop Thurzo a bit. Um, let's... God, what are we going to build? Um, a harbour is always good. Let's get us a wee harbour going up there. Growth can marry. Yes, away you go. Because that's that working on. I don't think there's anything we can do in St. Johnston. What about Durham then? What can we do in Durham? We are kind of building Durham up. We've got trade ports, logging camps, some forts. Um, mm -mm. Kind of like in military camps with the archer and skirmisher damage since we've got a hold of them, so let's get them constructed. May as well use our money. Declare wars and a powerful vessel wants a council position. Eh. Oh, right, the guy that we're going to try and murder. Of wait, of where? You got territory down over here. He's the count of down here as well. Interesting. Okay, well, okay, we've finished promoting culture. Uh, you know, you can't have a council position because we're going to kill you. Uh, we can ransom our... Yes, we need our air back. Uh, right, can we promote culture elsewhere? Um, who's this guy? My son. Wants a sewing kit. 
So he keeps fickle. We can give him content or we can give him trusting. Um, sure. Uh, let's promote culture up there. Uh, hello. You're a non believer. Well, let's blackmail you and get you in on murdering plots. Ah, our daughter is good at this. Yes, get me more hooks and then we'll go on a bit of a killing spree down there. What is the line of succession like for his, um... God, where is he again? Down here, oh yeah, well, it's, yeah, this area here that's apparently part of Alba. Um... Hi. So you are the... County of that, county of that, county of all of this nonsense. Let's have a look at Athol. Line of succession, oh good grief, we're nowhere in this line of succession. We're going to have to kill a lot of people. I think how it's going to work. Well, I mean, I'm not versed to a bit murder. Um, let's see, what else can we do? Uh, we can invite knights. How are we for knights? No, we're pretty good for knights. Uh, claimants, celibacy, pilgrimages, uh, feasts. Do we have a physician? We do not. Let's find one of them. I always need a good physician. Sweet him, good. Uh, so you're fifteen learning, ten learning. Sure, we'll take you for what it's worth. And then let's go on a pilgrimage to prove my dedication to God. Away we go. Uh, to Jerusalem, obviously. Yes, away we go. Go pilgrim. Uh What do we need to adopt um need Royal Prager. Oh, as my party passes through a small town, it's a throng of people filling the market square. In the centre, a man stands on an overturned fish cart, shouting wildly to all who will listen, The day of judgment is nigh, repent, repent, I say, or you shall be damned for all eternity. The worried looking townsfolk nervously whisper to each other, fearful of the doomsayer's words. Um Sure, I'm glad this pilgrimage comes to an indulgence. Or oh, that man is not a priest. Cast him down. Yes, give me that sweet, sweet piety. Um, yeah. What do we need to get? Primogeniture. I crown authority and the primogeniture innovation. Great. Uh, no, no, keep it up. I'm sure there's more secrets. Where's the primogeniture innovation? Is it in the current? No, it is not. Well, that's. Just upsetting. Is it in the high medieval period? Um, no. In the late medieval. Yes, it is. Well, we're not really seeing that for a while then. Uh, it's upsetting. Oh well, it is what it is. We'll just have to make do. It really do with getting rid of this spare air. Among my fellow pilgrims, there's a woman who preaches compassion and fellowship until she reaches the topic of heathens. One evening around the campfire, she loudly declares them to be abominable monsters in the eyes of God, deviants and child murderers all. Most people avert their eyes when she looks at them. Tonight, I was not quick enough. Do you not agree, O oh Queen? No, oh, they're not all that bad. Uh, which gives me... Yeah. Right, good disdain for heathens. 20% levy reinforcement rate for the same faith, which, you know, most things are. Yep, darn heathens. Can't trust them. Um. Okay, so we're away pilgriming. No other city in the world has a history quite like Jerusalem. 
In addition to the many other holy sites there, the city contains the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, built over the combined places where Jesus was crucified, buried and resurrected. Standing outside of the Temple Mount, with my hand on the western wall, I find myself reflecting on everything that happened on my journey to the City of Legend. I have walked the holy path. Pilgrim. Known for my dedication to faith. Oh yeah, look at me. Par we're we're a devoted servant heading towards that sweet, sweet paragon of virtue. Paragon I am. Or will be, probably. I don't know, it depends how long I live. Uh, my journey has been a long one, but I've finally come home again. While well, much remains the same, something has changed in how the priests and bishops treat me. I've undergone the journey of a holy woman, and they insist it has changed something about me. Whether I can see it myself or not, it is good to be home. Okay, what else should we be doing? Call hunt, which gets us some sweet, sweet uh, prestige, which is always good. Now what are we doing for our glorious, we're progressing towards glorious in our renown. Uh, we could call a hunt. I mean, our income's pretty solid, so... Sure, let's let's get let's go hunting. No longer overwhelmed by stress. I hadn't realised I was. Well, there we go. We'll go hunt. Blow off a bit of steam. Noise from others may have faded. Uh, the noise from the others have faded away by the time Vassal Mormor Agulf and I stalk upon the boar. We're almost within striking distance when Agulf whispers to me. Now that we are finally by ourselves, there's something I have to let you know about Gullnet. Who's that? That's my. The courtier, apparently. Uh, no time for chit chat. I'm getting the boar, which gives me prestige, or I gain stress. No, no, chit chat. No time for chit chat. Boar stab. Give me that sweet, sweet prestige. I don't know why this keeps telling me I have unread messages when I quite clearly don't. I'm just drawing to an end. We mount our horses, leave the hills behind. The servants prepare the boar that I stabbed, even though someone was trying to distract me. Uh, another game for the journey home by back. In spite of our difficulties along the way, the hunt went well. Hooray! Reinvigorated and more prestige. Who doesn't like a bit more prestige? Could be celibacy. We're not going to have any more kids at this point. Which, um, hang on. I've been overwhelmed by stress, okay. Okay, you know best. Uh, pot, dismiss this, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. If I gain celibate, I can't have children, revelers and seducers will like me less, but clergy will like me more and I get more piety. Sure, let's do that. Uh, new Archbishop, who endorses me, good. Uh, you finish finding secrets, and my friend is dead. Right, we've got some uh, stabbing to do somewhere down here. Um, let's murder this boy. What? Oh, good grief! That is not a great chance. How about her? Not a great chance. Hmm. Oh dearie me, am I just really bad at intrigue? Yes, I am pretty terrible at intrigue. Oh dear. Um, it's a good point. Where you help me with? You're just doing general assist rule. How's your intrigue? Yeah, plus three, but oh, sweet, sweet, plus ten. How are you doing that? Um, it does not look like it is going to go well. I mean, she'll give me twenty-seven scheme power. Let's give it a stab. <laughs> See what I did there. So we'll try and stab you. And then we will... See who we can get on board. Hi! Get, out, get into my scheme. Hi! Here's money. Come help me murder this this guy. Why you as well? Hey, have some cash. Yes, murder time. Okay, that's looking a bit better. Yeah, we're pretty good there. Uh, my dear As uh, Ascaric, I not have loved you, yet I feel your passing more acutely than I ever thought possible. You were always there, my constant companion. Did I take you for granted? There's so many things I left unsaid, and stress, great. Okay, okay. 
Hang on, we've got to deal with a stress problem. Uh, let's have a drink. Cheers. That's not quite done it. That's upsetting. Um, I'm in debt. I'll sort itself out before too long. Oh, I need to get married. Uh, find someone good at intrigue to help. What about Wido Boy here? <laughs> uh, he's beautiful, apparently. How do you feel about this Wido? Yes, come join. Get you to help me with my stabbing. Okay, Wido, let's... Uh... I know it's probably not pronounced that way, but it's funny. Yes, you're going to help me with intrigue with your massive intrigue skill. Accusations of sorcery. Bloodstained cloth, crow's feathers, strange smelling concoctions. This is the evidence prevented, uh, presented to me by a group of villagers from Durham as a proof that Congus has been practicing sorcery in his hut on the outskirts of their village. We just claim his evil works must be the cause of their sick animals and are calling for his execution. Ah, uh, he's a wise man. Oh dearie dearie me. But he's forgiving and gregarious and ambitious. And so I can upset the peasants, but gain 300 stewardship experience. Ooh. Or goes to 25, or I can burn him. Is them satisfied peasants or a sorcerer, you say? I could use a new advisor. Eh. Circumstantial. Let him go. How are we looking now on our stabbing? You see, that's what I'm talking about for stabbing. Yes, stab. This could do weird things to who holds what and kind of the succession. It'd be intriguing to watch. I want my lands back. But mine. You can't even have them. Uh, there we go. Stewardship perk. Excellent, excellent. Um, are we going down this? Oh, we should totally pick up golden obligations because, you know, it's funny. <laughs> Bribe people and get them to pay me. Show me the money. Okay, I'm curious to see if we manage this stab. I mean, we should do. It can take eight months, though. Waiting for us to be less in debt. There we go. Debt problem solved. I can declare wars. I'm sure I can. When is that ever not true? This this is this is gonna need dealing with at some point, I suspect. Africa. Just that bit. Apparently the rest of this is not Africa. It's just that bit right there. That's Africa. All of this is, I don't know, something else. Guinea, apparently. Uh, I was shocked when I caught a uh, fail car trying to steal from the travel chest of a visiting Count um, guy I'm trying to murder. I uh, blamed a game another child invented, but I could tell he was lying. You have to learn to get away with your lies, so I can keep deceitful, which is some intrigue and blah, 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 or I can give him honest, or I can give him humble. Yes, let's make him humble. Oh, good grief, I'm super stressed at the moment. That's not good. Don't know what I can do about my stressing. Knights Templar has been established in Terracina by the Pope. Well, go Pope. He is poping it up big. A small harbour in Thurzo. Good. That should increase our income somewhat. So where is all our income primarily coming from? The domain's not bad. Penfro is actually worth quite a bit. We're getting Durham up there. St. Johnson's worth a penny as always, and Thursday's worth a bit. Ugh, just a bit upset about having carefully built up all this stuff and then stupid succession laws. I tents in Durham, good. That gets our a bit more in the way of levying. Yeah, that's what I'm liking to see. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, how are we getting on? You're culturing, you're making people like me, you're making control better, we may have to spread that around a little bit, we'll see. You're helping me murder people, you're also helping me murder people. All good. All good. Got a physician there, it's always handy. One month until hopefully this Count Gun Guntram, you know, kicks it. 
Uh, you will attend a local celebration in Gowry. I happen to know he's a bit white. Oh, we're gonna... How many people are we gonna have bricked up in this cellar? I wonder if I'm gonna go down there to brick it, but it's just gonna be extra layers of walls. So, you, like, I'll have a wall, and if it gets torn down, there's, like, a guy entombed there. But there's another wall behind that. If you take that, there's another guy entombed there. And just, you know, how many walls deep does it go? Right, let's brick him up. Uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Queer new wall in the basement. Oh, dearie me. Okay, so let's have a look. Who's now in charge here? Uh, you are. Okay, and you're still down uh, here. Okay, so you're next on the stabbing list. Yep, murder you. Or are you straight up at a 95% chance? Outstanding. I'd like to see. Okay, well, I think that's probably a reasonable... Uh, oh, who wants a council position? You do. Um, no. Because A, you suck, and B, uh, you're going to be dead soon. Um... Yeah, look at all these people piling in to murder the new ruler of wherever. Uh, but yeah, I think that's a decent place for us to put a break in just now. Uh, so, you know, we're, we're, we're getting there bit by bit. I, this whole losing our kind of personal holdings is vexatious. Um, we're going to have to see what we can do about fixing that. I'm not entirely sure how we go about fixing that. Well, actually, I might have an idea about how we fix that, but... But yeah... Yeah, I'm going to have to think on this. Uh, it might take us a generation or two to sort out. Um, however, if you have enjoyed watching this, please do all the, you know, the standard YouTube stuff that, you know, us YouTuber types are always asking people to do. The liking, the subscribing, the commenting, the bell icon, all that kind of good stuff. Uh, it really helps the channel out, it helps the channel to grow, and it makes me very happy and is much appreciated. And as always, I will see you next time.